Hello everyone, this is Tony Mori. Join me on my visit to Keller Estate Winery on the Sonoma Coast. Keller Estate Winery was started in 1989 when the Kellers planted their first vineyard on a site overlooking Sonoma Coast's Petaluma River Valley. 100 acres of the winery's 690 acres are covered with vineyards. Grapes from the initial harvests were sold to other wineries, but the Kellers started building their own winery in the year 2000, which was completed in 2004. Keller Estate currently ships 11,000 cases per year, domestically and internationally. Let's hear more about Keller Estate Winery from tasting room manager Monica Zamstein. At the time, the Kellers were growing the grapes and selling it um, to local wineries. And in 2000, they decided to uh, build the winery. It was completed in 2004, and the label was started in 2000 as well. Um, we produce Pinot Noir and Chardonnay, what grows best here on the property, as well as some Viognier, Pinot Gris, and a cold climate Syrah. We make about 11,000 cases per year, so you would uh, consider us as a boutique winery still. It's all family owned um, by the Kellers. This property is about 680 acres, um, but about 100 acres of it is planted vines. And we also grow two different types of olive trees as well. We have a Mission and a Manzanillo olive tree, and we also make our own olive oil on the property. This property is what is known as the Petaluma Gap. Um, we are on a Sonoma Coast winery, but we're a little different than other wineries. We get two different fog banks that come in from the San Pablo Bay and also from uh, Bodega Bay in San Francisco. So what it does is it cools us off in the evening um, and in the morning, and then the fog burns away, and it allows for a longer growing season for our grapes. So we're actually not too high on sugar or alcohol. We're right around perfect uh, 13 to 14 percent alcohol. We produce uh, Chardonnay and Pinot Noirs. We have two different Chardonnays and two different Pinot Noirs. We produce a Pinot Gris, a Viognet, and a Cold Climate Syrah as well. Mainly we sell it um, through our tasting room. Um, with 11,000 cases, it's not a, as much to be out uh, in the retail marketplace, but we are in um, restaurants in Sonoma. Napa, San Francisco, Marin County, and then we are in some high-end retail shops throughout the country as well. We do import into Mexico, um, Europe, we have a distributor in the UK, um, Hong Kong, Japan, the Netherlands. Terroir is one of the more important aspects for us, obviously. The soil structure here on the property allows for our different varietals to have different uh, components, um, as well as the style of winemaking. Um, and other than that, um, obviously from my standpoint as a tasting room manager, the customer aspect, the educational uh, practices that I go ahead and explain to our guests so that they have the full rounded knowledge of how wine is made as well. Um, that is what the um, hospitality industry is all about. So we are here as wine educators first and foremost um, before anything else. So this is our La Cruz Chardonnay. It is actually um, what we consider here in the wine industry more of a um, buttery and oaky Chardonnay. It is aged in French oak barrels and does go through a secondary fermentation known as malolactic fermentation. This is about 2,500 cases made of this particular type of wine. And our Pinot, uh, Pinot Noir is our La Cruz Pinot Noir. It is um, all grown here on the property, all our grapes are state grown and uh, this is a little more of a fruit forward pinot. Um, has some great balance on it. All the wines are, have a perfect balance structure and we make about 3,000 cases of this particular um, wine. Thank you. 
Hi, my name is Monica Zumstein. I'm the assistant tasting room manager here at Keller Estates. We welcome you to come and enjoy a glass of wine with us. I hope you enjoyed visiting Keller Estate Winery. I'll see you guys next time.